Hi guys and welcome to Carflix. Today I'm going to show you how to fit some light brows on a 2010 Peugeot RCZ. So without further ado, let's crack on with that video. So we know how difficult it is to get some light brows for these things. They come up now and again, but generally they're really hard to get hold of. So what I'm going to do today is I'm going to make some myself. And the things you're going to need are some foil, a pen, some scissors, a knife, a heat gun, and some vinyl wrap. First thing we're gonna do is pop the bonnet. Lift your bonnet, and now we're gonna stretch this foil over the headlights, and we're gonna make a template. Then break two pieces of foil, roughly about 80 to 90 centimeters. Next, we're going to try and kind of squash and mold the foil over the top part of the headlight. It doesn't matter about the bottom part, just try and get the top part the best you can. Now, I know I said you needed two, but thinking about it, you probably only need one piece because we can flip this template around and it should cover the other light as well. So once you've kind of squashed it into the kind of lines of the lights, so you've got the basic shape of the top part. What we're going to do now is draw an outline to cut out and that's all you do is literally draw a line all the way where you want it so i just followed the natural curve of it doesn't have to be perfect you can always adjust it afterwards but yeah that's the basic shape and now i'm going to cut that off using some scissors now and there you have your basic shape cut out now so now what we're going to do is transfer this shape onto the vinyl wrap and there i've traced the outline of it and don't worry, it doesn't have to be perfect. We can make it smoother as we're cutting it out. And there is the basic shape cut out. Now, all we're gonna do now is flip this over and we're gonna put the template back on here and make an, another exact template for the other side. And there you have it. I've cut out two perfect pieces using the same template from the other one. So now we're gonna stick them onto the headlights. So this is it laid on roughly. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna peel it back and I'm gonna start heating it up and then I'm gonna stick it on and then just use a credit card to lightly smoothen it out. And then hopefully it should start taking shape. If you're enjoying this video so far, why not consider liking and subscribing? what I've done now is I've took the peeling off the back and I've laid it on really lightly because what I want to do is I've just got the corner on slightly I want to let the heat do the work with the heat gun all right so all I've done now is heated it up for about 30 seconds you can already see it started to stick to the light without me even touching it so now I'm going to use a credit card with a bit of the backing tape that's left over i'm going to squeeze it all out and see how i get on so let me explain the technique i've been using so basically once i've laid this this line on here what i've done is i pulled it right off i heated it and then what i've been doing with, the, with this credit card is kind of just do this to get the air bubbles out and if the air bubbles there i'll heat it back up pull it and then use my finger or this to push it out and you just keep doing that if you make a mistake just lift it up again and push the air this way now i've almost done it's not perfect i've got as many bubbles as i can out but there's still going to be a few because this isn't the style of vinyl that has the anti-air bubbles but i'm working with what i've got now when you come to the end of it what you want to do is the edges here heat them right up so it all falls into the gap and then what we're going to do is we're going to then cut the edges off so it's perfect as you can see as i've heated it's dropped all into the edge so all we're going to do now is cut the excess off with a blade i just use a cheap little blade here these are really sharp really cheap and then just cut the edges off and then once you've cut the edges off get your heat gun and just go along the edges just so they'll all stick to the edge of the light and now I'm gonna go and do the other side. And there you have it, guys. Look how sick that looks. And that cost me, what, five quid with some vinyl wrap. It ain't perfect. If you get really close up, you can see some bubbles here. 
Um, but I'm not a professional, I don't claim to be. That's probably the worst one. Some bubbles there, but you know, it's DIY. I've done it myself. It'll do until I get older some proper ones when they come available again. But look at that, how sick does that look? A great success! I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, please don't forget to like and subscribe. See you on the next one.